Massive revelations in Niger killing Rao. Niger's son Balraj Niger drops a big bombshell. Claims proximity of his father with Canadian intelligence agencies days before he was killed outside a Gurudwara in Canada's Surrey on June 18th earlier this year. Khalistani terrorist Hardeep Singh Niger was in regular touch with Canadian intelligence service and had met senior officials two to three days before he was killed in June this year. His son has claimed that Canadian intelligence authorities advised Niger to stay home days before he was murdered. Niger's son, Balraj Niger, has claimed to have accompanied his father when he held a meeting with Canadian intel officials. Amid India-Canada diplomatic standoff, in the latest former NIDG, YC Modi dropped a bombshell claiming that Canada is soft on terror because of which it has become a safe haven for Khalistani thugs. He has also added that whenever India has tried to deport or extradite any terrorists or Khalistani through talks with Canada, the Canadian government has never extended help. On Wednesday, the National Investigation Agency conducted raids at 53 locations across six states and one union territory in which dozen suspects were detained and arms and ammunition seized. These raids were aimed at dismantling the terror gangster drug smuggler nexus on weapon suppliers and logistics providers associated with various hardcore gangs and their operatives. Canada-based terrorists Arshtala, Lawrence Bishnoi, Sukha Dunke, Harry Moore, Narinder Lali, Kala Jatheri and Deepak Tinu are on the NIA's radar. Where terrorism is the question, this is the premier agency of the country. इसमें हम लोग रेगुलरली डिफरेंट कंट्रीज के हमारे जो काउंटर पार्ट्स हैं उनसे हम टच में रहते हैं उनकी एम्बेसी से टच में रहते हैं उनके पुलिस लियाजन ऑफिसर्स जो दिल्ली में हैं उनसे हम टच में रहते हैं और इंफॉर्मेशन शेयरिंग होती है ये अलग अलग देश का रिस्पांस अलग अलग रहता है कुछ देश हमारी दी गई इंफॉर्मेशन पर बहुत तेजी से रिएक्ट करते रहे हैं जबकि कनाडा के बारे में मैं अफसोस से कहता हूं कि हम लोगों ने बहुत इंफॉर्मेशन उनके साथ रेगुलरली शेयर की है हमारे लेवल पर भी और भारत सरकार के लेवल पर भी पर अफसोस की बात यह है कि वहां से जो रिस्पांस मिलना चाहिए वो रिस्पांस नहीं मिला है Sand Singh Chatwal, a prominent Indian-American businessman based in New York, spoke out about the unwavering love and loyalty of Sikhs towards India. He emphatically stated that over 99% of Sikhs have a deep affection for their homeland and rejected any notion of widespread support for Khalistan, emphasizing that extremist elements discussing this issue have never set foot in Punjab. Listen it. I'm very clear that there are very, very less people over here I don't know who's funding them, those who have never been to Punjab. I'm proud to be sick. I'm in this country more, more than 50 years. I visited India, and the leadership of Modi has done a great job. He opened for six Kartarpur corridor. He had done a Baldev's Day, and he has done a lot for six. Six are in a very prominent position in India. We have our Sikh prime, uh, over, uh, one of the ministers, Hardeep Singh Puri. Now, suspicion is being raised about the involvement of Pakistan toolkit behind Khalistani provocation. According to sources who spoke to India today, the ISI is seeking the help of Pakistanis living abroad in order to make this whole Khalistan conspiracy successful. Additionally, during the past few days, there have been attempts to spread this Khalistan conspiracy via social media. Intelligence agencies have allegedly identified hundreds of social media accounts that have been fueling Khalistani conspiracy against India. Provocative anti-India information is being produced by suspicious accounts, including hashtags and inflammatory posts. Meanwhile, former NIA DG YC Modi has made a similar claim. He says that Pakistan's ISI is engaged in terror funding. ये पाकिस्तान के बारे में तो हम सब सदा से जानते हैं पाकिस्तान ने कश्मीर में भी प्रॉब्लम क्रिएट किए हैं करते रहे हैं अभी भी करते हैं पहले पंजाब में भी प्रॉब्लम उन्होंने क्रिएट करने की कोशिश की थी उसके पर, उस पर काबू पा लिया गया था और अब भी वो एक उनका उनकी तरफ से एक लगातार ये प्रयास रहता है जिसके लिए वो विदेशों में 
जहां जहां भी उनकी एम्बेसीज हैं जहां जहां भी उनको इस काम के लिए लोग मिल सकते हैं उस पर वो लगे रहते हैं